I introduce another term called performance. Okay, the performance of the material in certain environment has to be satisfactory. Okay, it has to be useful under certain application. And also, it has to save the environment. Okay, it has to be environmentally friendly. Therefore, in this case, when people ask you, what is material science and engineering? You're going to tell them, it's no longer the relationship between process and structure and properties. It's the relationship between processing, structure, pro property, and performance. Okay, so we have four factors. Okay, for this definition of material science and engineering. Come on, take them. Tetrahedron of material science and engineering. Oh, I'm sure I Tetrahedron. I'm not tetrahedron. Tetrahedron is a shape, something like this. So, this is now, the relationship between processing, structure, properties, and performance are called the tetrahedron of MSE. So,
陶瓷的，还有学金属的，还是学半导体的，还是学复合材料。好，所要研究的不外乎就是它的什么动力结构、性能和浮力、本领、使用性能之间的这么一个关系。所以以后，咱们上了裁测机了啊，到现在不能再不知道你是干什么的啊。大家问你是干什么的，你说我是研究结构、浮力、性能和浮力、本领之间关系的科学人，科学科学人。或者工程技术的，好吧。All right, let's keep going. Thanks. 